Hello everyone, today we're going to work, be working on a iPhone XR with a broken LCD. First thing we're going to do is take out the bottom panel of screws. I will have a link to all the tools and screens we used in the description for your reference. You go in from the side. And don't go too deep, you don't want to mess anything up. Just slowly pry up. Go to the other side. Now again, this opens to the right, just like the sevens, eights. Now you need your tri-point screw driver. I'll take out the battery bracket. Put them in order. Put all screws in order. Okay, that's our battery bracket. We're gonna take off the LCD off the touch and uh, the bracket off of the <laughs> LCD connector and the touch connector. That's that. Now for our earpiece speaker and face ID. This flex right here is related to face ID. If you damage this, rip it or anything, face ID will not activate. Now this top one over here is a Phillips for some reason and it's bigger than all the other screws. This is exactly what I'm saying, keep all the screws in order so you know which screw goes into which hole. You don't want to put a long screw into a short screw hole. Disconnect the battery. Disconnect the touch and the earpiece. That's it. The aftermarket screen on here already then we're going to take off this screw again keep these in order first one's a tri-point and the three others are Phillips This one comes off easy, but I us usually take it off with the bracket. I'll go underneath and slowly lift, but this one's already been replaced, so it's off. Put this to the side, put this bad screen to the side, get the new screen, pop this guy off. Put this guy back, put the tri-point screw. Phillips screw. Okay. My screen comes with the plate and screws already assembled to it, so it saves me a lot of time. Hook the earpiece speaker first. Screen afterwards. <laughs> Connect the battery. Now you're just going to put the brackets on.
Okay, line this up nicely. Line the top up. Look out for any access screws from the old screen. I was about to break this screen because of it. Once you lined it up, it goes right into place. Put the panel up screws back in. Fire it up. Okay, I'm gonna move it away from the camera because this customer has their family's pictures on. I'm gonna keep it private. And I'll be right back, test the screen. All right. Touch is good and we are all good. Please like and subscribe for more repair videos. Thank you and have a great day.